Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to share with you how I personally warm up. Keep in mind that the whole purpose of warming up is to increase blood flow into the muscles you will be training. Shoulder joints enable mobility across many different angles, so to loosen up your shoulders before a training session is key. Rotational dislocates with a band is a good place to start. You can achieve global mobility in your shoulder joints with this movement. Perform 15 reps, nothing too crazy. Couple this with band pull-aparts to activate the muscles of your upper and mid-back. Experiment with your hand grip to see what suits you best, but remember to get a good squeeze at the end range. A staple exercise in my opinion. Next, the overhead press. A drill with no weights that will continue to increase blood flow into the shoulder area. 15 reps are more than enough here. Forward flexion is next and front raises are great to get the job done. Again, 15 reps will suffice. Make sure you lift your arms over your head without arching your spine too much. From anterior deltoids, we move on to side raises to emphasize the lateral head of your delts. Go for high reps, 15 to 20. This exercise looks kind of weird, I know, but it's an excellent way to isometrically engage your core when you perform shoulder extension and external rotation of the arms by twisting your hands at the end of the pull. Next on the list is an exercise I personally like very much because it allows me to dynamically warm up all three heads of my shoulders at once. Again, the leaning forward position will force your core to stay engaged as you do this exercise, which I call all-rounders. Before you get down to the floor, I would encourage you to do some wrist activation work. Interlock your fingers and try to draw circles in both directions. Down there, the first thing you might want to try is to activate your scapula. Get on your force and perform retraction and protraction of your shoulder blades. This muscle has a key stabilization function for all upper body exercises. This next drill ramps up the intensity a tiny notch. You'll feel a good engagement of your chest, shoulders and triceps all working together. Nothing too taxing but hard enough to signal your central nervous system that something more challenging is around the corner. I always like to include some rotation to my warm-ups. Side-to-side -side rotational planks are great. Pivot through your toes and heels every time you rotate. A full body drill to get you ready for action. Let's not forget the rotator cuff. With your arm tucked in, you want to pull the band by externally rotating your shoulder. Grab a light resistance band and perform a high number of reps in different angles. You can also step on the band and pull it in a vertical line. The range of motion is not supposed to be huge here guys, so don't try to force it. Now that the general warm-up is over, it's time to get exercise specific. Here I'm sharing two examples on how to use warm-up sets. Make sure that you perform at least two warm-up sets for any exercise of your routine. You want to start small and gradually increase the load to your target weight. Do not jump straight away into your working set. Ease your way into it and you'll be grand. Don't get distracted by the badass tank talk I'm wearing here. Remember that this is all about injury prevention and shoulder health. I hope you found this video helpful guys. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like, comment and all the rest. Thanks for watching, my happy face pullers.